I was thinking about the famous celebrities that um, sometimes sing a gospel song. You know, there are many celebrities in the music business that uh, just because they do a gospel song or just mention God in that song, confused Christian people right away say that that celebrity knows about Jesus Christ because they have sung a song about Jesus Christ. So right away, they believe that that celebrity is a Christian and is saved. Well, this is far from the truth. You see, the world sees you as a Christian. God does not see you as a Christian. He sees you as a saint, his child. If you look throughout the Bible, whenever God mentions his children, he calls them saints. It's in both the Old and New Testament. You see, the name Christian was uh, invented by pagans and you you see that uh, name Christian oh, a couple of times in the New Testament but it was always the pagans that would call believers Christians they are saints followers of Jesus Christ you know a saint is a child of God he is part of the body of Jesus Christ those singers may have sung a gospel song, but they are far from being followers of Jesus Christ. Salvation is not just about believing in Jesus Christ. That is half the story. If we believe that Jesus Christ, in whom he said that he is, that he is the Son of God, and that he is God in the flesh, then we must obey him. We must accept him as our Lord, our Savior, our Master, our King, and we must submit ourselves to him. We have to follow and obey him, or else our faith is in vain. Just because a sinner sings one gospel song, it does not mean they are saved. If we are truly followers of Jesus Christ, we will take his words seriously. He said to his disciples, One is your teacher, even the Christ. Jesus Christ himself, he gives his Holy Spirit in those who accept him, who repent of sin and who obey him, who seek his will, who seek his guidance. And the Holy Spirit will teach them and will guide them into the whole truth. They do not run after other teachers. They go after Jesus Christ. They listen to the Holy Spirit. They are led by the Holy Spirit. Those who are led by the Spirit of God, they are the sons of God if we truly follow Jesus Christ. We do not listen to other teachers. We do not listen to Bible teachers who are in reality just hirelings on staff in their churches. We listen to the Holy Spirit because we know him and we have received him and the Spirit of Christ dwells in us. Have you received the Holy Spirit, the Spirit of Jesus Christ? Does he teach and guide you? Are you a child of God? Are you truly a follower of Jesus Christ? Or are you just like the celebrity who sings a gospel song once in a while? If you do not follow Jesus Christ, you will perish because Jesus himself is the way and the truth and the life. His Spirit, the Holy Spirit in you, is Emmanuel. God in you, God with you, God guiding and teaching you. The famous celebrity who sings a gospel song knows about Jesus Christ but does not follow him. This is what the Lord says about these type of people. In Matthew chapter 15, verse 8, this is what the Lord says. These people honor me with their lips, but their hearts are far from me. 
God bless you all. Praises and worship, you are my God. Father, your arms are covering my life. My sins all cover your blood, the prize. O oh, Son of God, so precious your love. Hallelujah. I sing the song of the Lord. song of the Lord, hallelujah, I sing the song of the Lord, hallelujah, I sing the song of the Lord, the Lord in His mercy, His work on the cross. Jesus, my Savior, your gift of love, creator of heaven, creator of earth, all in thy hands, the gift of the cross, hallelujah, I sing the song of the Song of the Lord, Hallelujah. I sing the song of the Lord, Hallelujah. I sing the song of the Song of the Lord. 